For this video, I am going to teach you how to give your accountant access into your Zero account. So the first thing that you need to do is to head over to the official website. It is at zero.com and then just, just log in into your account using your credentials. And if you don't have an account yet, you can just try their free trial or use their free trial and then create an account or sign up with your credentials and your details so once you have successfully logged in then you'll land on the dashboard of zero so then from here you'll be able to see your username or your name on the upper left corner of the screen so once you've clicked onto it this drop menu will appear and head over to settings so once you are in your settings you'll be prompted or you'll be able to see these different sections right here go to users it should be the second option in there so once you are in your settings then you'll be able to see this or on your the user section of your settings so once you are in here hit this invite a user button situated on the upper right corner of your screen click onto it and then this is where you'll need to fill in all of the personal details of your accountant so you just need to enter their first name last name their email and then once you have done that then you'll have an option so some options that you can allow your accountant to have access to in your account so you can add allow them to use or to see your projects okay, payroll admin and then you can also select the level that they can have or they can or yes they can have into your account so for example for projects they can just have limited access standard or admin access so you can basically do that for the other one so i'm just going to check all of it and now for this managed users i recommend you to do this one because your some accountants have their employees or have other employees that they delegate their tasks to or the accounting tasks to so this option will allow them to do just that so they will not need to contact you for them to be able to add their employees to do their tasks so you can also add message or personalize the invite if you want to hit check this add message and then just construct your message into this section right here so once you have done all of that once you have added all the details and check all the options that you want or the permissions that you want your accountant to have access to you just need to head over to the bottom part of your screen and click the send invite button and then after that your accountant will have access once they have opened their email and accept the invite then they have access into your um, zero account so that's it for this video and i hope this helped you and if it did please make sure to like subscribe and hit the notification bell button thank you so much for watching and have a great day